Good afternoon, Pastor David. Hey, John. Welcome to Unfiltered. Pastor, today I wanted to ask you, what's the, well, our, this the whole week at our church, we've had what is called Vacation Bible School for our children. And our campus has been filled with kids. What's the importance of having such things like VBS or Vacation Bible School? Well, you know, when you have children who are or one in need of, of socialization, in need of relationship after the COVID thing, where children were masked and incapable of spending time with, playing with, speaking to uh, other children. It, it was very destructive for them. It was destructive for their their um, emotional well-being. And it was so terrible in some, some cases, some children even ended their lives. And, and I, I'm not speaking about you know, older kids, high school age. I'm talking about uh, hearing stories of children who were less than 10 years old who were so depressed and afraid and and so lacking of any uh, human contact that they uh, they actually, uh, they took their own lives. So I see the uh, VBS as a very important, very, very important uh, uh, time for the children to be able to to be kids, to have uh, opportunities to sing songs together, to play games together, to be taught about the Lord. And so we've had uh, a number of kids here on campus for the last few days, and I'm in my office and I can hear them <laughs> as they're singing and as they're cheering. And uh, I, my heart just uh, is so blessed by that because they're having an opportunity to have fellowship and their emotional and social needs to be met. John, so I think that's very important, but I especially believe it's important because it is uh, founded on Bible stories and the reality of faith in Christ, and and that to me is a blessing. And so VBS is something that I think is a, a very good and very important part of our church. We've been having vacation Bible uh, schools for many years now, and um, and it's it's suiting the purpose. The children need to get out of their houses. They need to get away from their uh, their iPads and iPods and, and, and all of that. Get out of the computer. They need to go outside. They need to laugh and play. They need to be with other kids. And they need to do so under supervision. There's a lot of kids who are left alone at home all day long. And the only thing they have is a, a TV set or a computer. So here the kids have been... Uh, gathering by uh, great numbers, and we've been very blessed to see them uh, hearing about the Lord. We uh, will uh, celebrate birthdays, you know, and <laughs> it's just great, John, so it's been a great week. Well, you know, even the amazing thing about it is the servants oh, yes. that have come in and have taken their week vacation that mm -hmm. they planned for years, and mm -hmm. we're having quite a number of servants that have come and given up their vacation time to come spend with the children here at the church. You know, I'm so blessed to see that. One of the people that are in our church that have been serving the the, the Lord through ministering to the kids actually drive from the high desert every wow. day. They take their vacation or a portion of their vacation. They drive down here and every day of the week, they help to oversee and run the VBS. And we have well over 500 uh, volunteers mm -hmm. who are here serving and helping the children and, um, I'm just blessed by that, John, to, to see the, the heart to invest in the lives of children and the ministry here to those kids. Great blessing. Amen. Well, thank you guys for tuning in. Pastor, thank you for sharing that. Uh, just a reminder that we do have our church services at 8.30 and 10.45 on Sunday morning. Pastor Dave, you're taking us through Acts chapter 6, snapshots mm -hmm. of Acts. And so I want to invite you guys to come out and join us. And then on Sunday afternoon, immediately after second service, we have our Israel meeting, informational meeting in the sanctuary. If you want to come check it out, have questions or want to register, we'll be there to answer any questions that you may have. Pastor, thank you again for joining us. Of course. Thank you guys for tuning in and God bless you.